In this video, we're going to take a look at the question that turned up in an interview at Cambridge. Which of the following is the larger number? Square root of 2 or the cube root of 3? Feel free to pause the video, give it a go, and resume when you're ready. Also, don't forget to give a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. You might wonder why are Cambridge interview questions so easy? They might look innocent, but the interview itself is not as easy as it seems. All the tools you have are a few sheets of paper and a pen, so obviously no calculators. Also, interviewees are required to present their answers verbally, so only, only those who can think aloud, as in thinking about the problems and saying out their thoughts at the same time, stand a chance in getting an offer. Now back to the main problem. So I'm going to rewrite these two numbers into indices form. For example, square root of 2 is going to be rewritten as 2 to the power of a half, while cube root of 3 is going to be rewritten as 3 to the power of 1 third. The two most convenient ways to compare two powers are to either rewrite the index so the indices of the two numbers are equal. Then we can compare the base. What well, the uh, larger base is then um, the larger number because the indices for these two numbers are positive. Or we can rewrite um, the numbers so that the bases are the same. Then we can compare the indices. So I would rather go for rewriting the indices instead. Now notice that these two numbers are both about 2 and 3. So I'm going to consider the LCM of these two numbers, which is 6. So I'm going to rewrite the half as 1 6 times 3, while the power 1 third to be 1 6 times 2. Then the two powers become 2 to the 3 and the whole power to the power of 1 6 or the other number is 3 squared and the whole number to the power of 1 6. Now I've somehow managed to rewrite the indices of the two numbers into the same number which is 1 6 and now we can compare the bases directly. The base of the number derived from square root of 2 is 8. The base is 8. While the base of the other number is 9. So we can quickly see that cube root of 3 is larger than square root of 2. To present this verbally, I'm going to say that because square root of 2 is the sixth root of 8, while the cube root of 3 is the sixth root of 9. So by comparing directly, we can say that cube root of 3 is larger. I hope you enjoyed the video. Feel free to suggest any alternatives in the comments. If you like my videos, make sure to subscribe to my channel right now. Thank you for your support. See you next time.